Hey, welcome to whole number of problem. So we are doing mastery level seven. So the objective is to learn to count in groups instead of individual objects. The second objective is to calculate the minimum amount needed to buy the maximum number of things. So in the example one, Cedric want to buy nice shirts. For every three shirts he bought, he can get one more free shirt. Every shirt costs $5. So why the smallest sum of money needed by Cedric? So first, the keyword is nice shirts, but every three shirt he bought, there's one more free shirt. So for the nice shirt, okay, if you draw out, you don't buy in three yet. You put it in four. Okay, so. 9 divided by 4, you can have 2 remainder 1. Then, in this book, right, instead of getting 4 shirts, you just need to get 3 shirts because there's 1 free. So, after you take 9 divided by 4, you got 2 remainder 1. Here, you find out that 1 set of 4 shirts is actually 3 times $5, $15. So, total there are 2, two sets. So, you total 15 $30. And for the remaining one shirt, you just need to add the five dollar. So the smaller sum of money needed by surgery is thirty five dollar. So in mastery level eight, we learn to go them and find out the number of group and find the total quantities of object. So example one, Roger buys some books and pen and the number of books bought is twice the number of pen bought. So one book costs $4 and one pen costs $1. So if Roger has $72, how many books can he buy? First, let's highlight the keywords. The book bought is twice of the pen box. So if you draw a model, you have the book and pen, and book is two unit, pen is one unit. So one book costs four dollar, and one pen costs one dollar. So four, four, and the one. So one set itself, okay, is how much? So you say Roger is seventy two dollar. How many books can you buy? First, you find out your value of one set. There will be two of, of the four dollar plus one dollar. So this whole set is nine dollar. Then you take seventy two dollar because Roger is seventy two divided by nine, and you can see that ah these are the eight sets that Roger can buy, and one set itself there are two books. So eight sets of two books will be sixteen books in total. Example two, Ashley was given a drug to make 90 toys, so he made two toys each day from Monday to Friday. You know, here, there's an S. And he made five toys each day on Saturday and Sunday. So starting on Sunday, which day of the week did Ashley complete the job? So let's find out one week itself will be two plus two plus two plus two plus two plus five plus five. That will be 20 toys in one week. So you take 90 toys, divide by 20 toys in one week. So there will be four weeks of toys with remaining 10 toys. So the day we know that you will come back on Sunday, since you do it on Sunday. So for the remaining 10, okay, we will take away the Sunday, 5, because it's not on Sunday, take away. The next day, which Monday to till which Tuesday to, so there is one more. So actually completed the job on Wednesday.
Okay, now we come to mastery level nine. So for mastery level nine, it's working backward with Peter identity or working back with internal transfer. So let's do an example one. Okay, there are 67 boys and girls in a field. So after seven boys have left the field, there are twice as many boys as girls. So how many girls are there? So this is the model. So there are twice. So you can see that there are two units of boys, one unit of girl. So here is the seven. Okay. So 67 minus seven will get one, two, three. So these are the three units. One, two, three. Then one unit is 60 divided by 3, so 20. And because girls has one unit, so answer is 20 girls. Example 2. Kelly and Melvin had 100 marbles all together. After Melvin gave 15 marbles to Kelly. So this is internal transfer. So 15 put it over down here. And Kelly had four times as many marbles as Melvin. So how many marbles did Melvin have at first? So you take your 100, okay, divide by five. Because in the end, there are five units. So five units, 100. Then divide by five to find your one unit. So Melvin now is 20. So it asked at first, so add back to 15. So Melvin has 35 marbles at first. 